Hey everyone, meet Skin Wagon. <sighs> the, the old, old dude about to eat a sandwich. And today, we're gonna eat a sandwich. An old guy is. Should I show him on you? Yeah, someone left yeah. a comment said, we need to come here to watch an old, old man eat a sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> when did he come here? I don't know. <laughs> we have two two sandwiches here. Um, what are they? The, the Wagyu Steakhouse. Hold on. Arby's. Yeah, thank you, Josh, from uh, Yesco for recommending this one. Because Arby's now has the meats. This is a Deluxe Wagyu Steakhouse Burger. And he's got the ranch, bacon ranch, Wagyu Steakhouse Burger. And we got the, the large, as you can see, there's... This is the large. A lot of room in there, and I haven't had any yet, so it's kind of a waste of money. Don't get the large. Yeah, they are pretty good, though. I'm not complaining. A little bit, but I'm not. I think they're good fries. All right, let's see which one this is, because we didn't... I think this is mine. I don't know if that's ranch or just burger sauce. But oh, those fries are good. So I had pickles, onion... And it looks like lettuce and tomato. Okay. I do not like tomato. It's fine if I pull it off. You're supposed to eat the sandwich as he has. All right, all right, all right. All right. So, for the record, I've never had um, Wagyu before, you know, the steak. And uh, I think it's unfortunate that this is going to be my first example or my first uh, taste of Wagyu. The Arby's Burger, one that specializes in deli bread. I got the, the ranch, uh, the bacon ranch, and I'm not a big bacon fan. I should have got yours. You should have got this one. I'm not a big bacon fan, but I'm going to try it. And meat skin's right. I mean, our, my first taste of Wagyu, if it really is, it, is coming from Arby's, who they do deli meats. So where's McDonald's and Burger King at? Now, here's the thing. It's supposed to be... Uh, Medium rare. Look at that charred thing. Yeah, it's definitely charred on the outside, but it's cooked medium rare. So I'm actually I'm gonna go to knife. I'm gonna cut it in half. Okay. So maybe if we forked out uh, four hundred dollars, we could try Wagyu. Where's your sword? <laughs> but. Alright, let's let's cut this baby in half. I'm not a I'm not a big steak guy, I'm more of a baby back barbecue ribs from uh I'm probably I can like, more. I like the dullest knife. <laughs> what that even cut? It's not serrated, it just cuts butter. Popping knife. You didn't even cut that part. Oh, here we go. Okay, oh, okay. here we go. That not look too bad. No, it looks alright. Oh, good. Yeah, that's a little medium rare. You got a lot of sauce kind of soaking out of the... Uh... You got like that that uh, McDonald's sauce on there, the, the Italian mm -hmm. dressing. All right, so what do you think, Mason? Diving in? No, I'm just going to dive in, take one bite, and uh, probably going to take the pickles and the tomatoes off after the first bite. Give it a fair... Look at that. Fair share. That's not... Oh. That looks pretty good. Oh, here we go. I just taste pickle. I barely got a bite of pickle. Look at that onion. <laughs> <laughs> One little onion on there. One little slab of onion. And there's so much sauce that when I bit down, it all went out the other end. Um, I'm almost going to take that tomato off so I can take it. I should have got one without the bacon because the bacon's crispy and I'm just not a fan. I'm not really tasting the meat yet. Yeah, I, I don't. I don't know if I tasted anything. I mean, it's just all sauce. It's just. It's all sauce. We got a lot of sauce on there. This one, I had one bite of pickle, and that's it, that was an overpowering flavor. Mm -hmm. Pickle. I mean, I'm glad they put sauce on this burger. I wish they would have did the same with our fish fillets. Mm. That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. But here's the deal. 
are you going to Arby's for this again, or are you just going to go to McDonald's or Burger King for a Whopper and a Big Mac? Probably a Whopper. I mean, this isn't anything really special. Um, there's a, really not a, a whole lot of flavor going on here. Um, the sauce that they use doesn't, it's not satisfying. I have ranch dressing on mine, and I think I'd rather have the Italian dressing. Mm-hmm. The RB secret sauce. Are you one of them? Yeah, you throw, throw on there. It's really not bad. Mm. I'm, I'm disappointed. It's not like... The burger's not like flavorful. No. It is. Mine's flavorful. Once you get past all the other crap that's on it. Okay. That bite did not have bacon on it. It didn't have a tomato. didn't have a pickle. That bite had a piece of onion and the beef. It was pretty good. It, it actually was good. So I definitely have to try this again, but kind of get less less of the junk that's on there. Mm -hmm. I mean, now it's like there's no sauce on there. It's all soaked in. Uh, it, it's... Hold on, let me take another bite because I'm, I'm kind of mixed on this one. Mm. Mm -hmm. No? Mm. I don't like it. It's. it's Got a weird texture to it too. It's like um, like really chewy. It's pink, but it's really like chewy and kind of. I don't know. I mean, it's got a nice crunch to it. It's weird. I like it. I do like it. I'm not, I'm not used to. I'm used to that processed fake patty crap from a McDonald's or Burger King. I'm used to Wendy's. I don't like Wendy's. Fresh, never frozen. Mm. Mm. I do not like Wendy's. I love Wendy's. Okay, well, what do you think? Wrapping it up? Yeah, I mean, so are you going to go get this again? I'm, I'm not. I'm not going to go out of my way to Arby's. To no, I'm going to I'm gonna go into McDonald's or Burger King. I'm not going to make a special trip out for this. Mm -hmm. Just, I don't eat at Arby's. And it's just, I don't know. And I know the comments are already going to come. I took everything off the burger. Of course, it has no flavor. No, 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 no. I'm, I want to taste the meat. It's Wagyu. But, yeah, it's, it's, here, you know what? It's no different than a normal burger made here at home. I don't think it is. I think, uh, if we wanted a medium rare burger, we can make it here at home. I don't think you're right. I, if we just grab the meat and take a bite of the meat, that's all it is. And that really does look good. But it was a good try, Arby's. You had the meats, but it's not the meats I'm looking for. Uh, I'm not looking for meat. <laughs> he might, but I'm not looking for meat. <laughs> I'm looking for a vagina. Oh, they're meaty. <laughs> they can be. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. All right, well, thanks for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more videos. I just popped uh, a new video in my noggin here, but I don't know if we'll ever do it. But what is it? You gonna tease me? Oh, Arby's has a uh, loaded bacon cheese fries. Wendy's has bacon eater fries. McDonald's had their own bacon cheese fries, but it was gross because the cheese was flavored with bacon. It was like a bacon flavored cheese. It was really, really bad. Hmm. But maybe we can compare those. Huh. All right, we'll see. Well, let's know what you think, guys. Thanks, Josh. It, this, it was pretty good. Thank you. We'll see you. Bye. Bye, everybody. Goodbye.